She doesn't want to testify in a death penalty case because of her beliefs, and now a devout Mennonite is being held in contempt of court. A district court judge is trying to compel her testimony in the Robert Ray case. He's the man on death row here in Colorado, and prosecutors are trying to uphold his sentence. Well, Denver 7's Lance Hernandez talked to the woman's husband, pastor, and attorney today, Lance. Grenda Linda, or Greta Linda Krantz doesn't want to have anything to do with helping put someone to death. She's an investigator who was originally hired by Robert Ray's defense team to help in Ray's defense. Ray was sentenced to death for the slaying of a witness to another shooting. Now prosecutors want her to testify in a hearing to uphold his death penalty. Lord, guide my feet while I'm Two Mennonite congregations sang in front of the Arapahoe County Justice Center today to draw attention to Greta Lindekrantz's plight. I hope, frankly, that it embarrasses the prosecution, not because I have any beef against them as human beings, but I think that the process that's in, um, at play here is toxic and deathly. Reverend Vern Rempel says he talked with Linda Krantz at length on Saturday about her decision not to testify after getting a subpoena. The next day she came to church and she said, I have such clarity that I need to do this. Greta's husband said there were tears when he talked to her today, but she remains resolute in her religious beliefs. She's very adamantly opposed to killing another human being, legally or otherwise. Regarding the contempt ruling, the judge said it was a difficult decision, but it was an important one to make to move these decisions forward. What we just witnessed... Attorney Mari Newman disagreed. ...was a fundamental miscarriage of justice. Newman asked the judge for a lesser penalty, saying this wasn't a trial and there was no jury. She added that Linda Krantz respects the families of the victims. If the state weren't seeking to execute Mr. Ray, she would happily testify, and she said as much tearfully in front of the court yesterday. Now, I asked the district attorney's office why Linda Krantz's testimony is so important to this case. A spokeswoman said they typically don't talk about ongoing proceedings outside the courtroom. Anne?